Hey guys, so welcome to my YouTube channel and today I will be making pink glow in the dark slime in honor of breast cancer awareness Month. These are the things that you need. A bowl, some mixing tools, some glue, shaving cream. I'm using this glow puff paint, baking soda, contact solution and extras if you want it so let's get started I'm going to pour in my glue I'm using a whole bottle now I'm going to just add my shaving cream Now I'm going to just add my paint. I'm hoping this is going to glow in the dark. Now I'm going to mix it up. I'm going to add some contact solution. It's forming. I think I need some more. I don't think I need. Baking soda and water is activated and contact solution, so you can use either one. This is what it's looking like. So fluffy. I need, right now I need some more color. I'm adding more. Oh, come on. And this is this is what I'm, the paint that I'm adding and it is puff paint and it should add a little bit more puff to it. Oh look how puffy it is. Ooh, it looks like bubblegum. Okay. Ooh. Now I need to add some more contact solution because it's sticky. Ooh, it's forming. Let me see, I need more. Yes, I need more. <sighs> Woo, that looks so pretty. I can't wait to add my extras. I'm just so hoping it works. But either way, if it doesn't work, it's still a pretty slime. This is so fluffy. Kind of want to add some more. Um, Shaving cream, but I don't think I need any more. I probably need to add some baking soda and water. Oh my god, this is so oh fluffy. God, it's so fluffy. This is so sticky. So I'm trying, I'm going to try to make it non sticky. Let me try to put it in the Still sticking, but I think I'm going to add some else, something else to it. You don't want to put too much baking soda. It's not sticking that much no more. I can actually work with it. It's so stretchy too. Wow. This is so stretchy. I'm just going to add a little bit more puff paint and just getting all the scraps out of here. That's more puff paint. I'm using all of this. I want to add my extras and get all the leftover slime. My hand. Add this one and this one. So I just put two packets in there. Oh my God, it's taking the color off the sequin. Now it's gonna be even more pink. So let me mix that up. I'm just hoping it's gonna glow. Woo. You can see it inside of it, so pretty. Oh, you're 
so stretchy and fluffy. You can see the two different pinks in there. Now I'm gonna add one more because it's looking so pink. I'll just mix them in. They look so pretty, I mean. Now let's do the Potex. Is is really really palpable, and but and it's very stretchy and fluffy. I say it's a success, but at least to give it glow. So it's glowing a little bit, but it's not on camera. It's not picking it up on camera. Yeah, it's glowing a little bit. Okay, so it really didn't glow on camera. But you could see it a little bit, but it wasn't on camera. Really pretty, stretchy, and fluffy pink. This is so pretty. I love it. It's probably the best slime I ever made by myself. This slime is so pretty. It doesn't glow in the dark on camera, but when you holding it, in person you can see it a little bit so it's kind of a fail on the glow in the dark part but the slime part is not a fail it's not sticky no more it's very pretty fluffy pinky <laughs> so yeah so yeah so i hope you like this video on this slime it's it wasn't a fail but it just didn't glow in the dark for real. So next time I will be using glow sticks on another glow in the dark video. So you need to um, stay on tune, tune on that video. So like this video, click that bell, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye. Making pink fluffy. Fluff. Okay. I don't know a uh, breast cancer awareness plum. So let's jump into the YouTube video. Let's jump into <laughs> <laughs>